Hello students, welcome back to our class. In the previous session, we discussed about similarity criterion and in which cases two triangles are said to be similar. Under the similarity criterion, how many conditions are there like AA similarity criterion, SSS similarity criterion and SAS criterion. But in the previous class, we discussed about AAA similarity criterion. So, in this class, we are going to discuss about SSS similarity criterion. So, what is this? SSS similarity criterion is all about SSS similarity criterion. Similarity criterion. See in this SSS similarity criterion, you are given two triangles. The sides of one triangle are respectively proportional to the sides of the other triangle. Then their corresponding angles are equal. We already discussed this is the converse of AAA similarity. Hope you understand, right. So, according to the similarity criterion, what is the statement? If all the three sides, all the three sides of one triangle, all the three sides of one triangle are respectively proportional. are respectively proportional to the corresponding sides to the corresponding sides of the another triangle corresponding sides of the another triangle then their corresponding angles are equal, then their corresponding angles are equal. This is what is SSS similarity criterion. Let us try to prove the similarity criterion and remember one thing, in order to prove this SSS similarity criterion, we can use AAA similarity criterion. Means what? If you can identify three angles of one triangle are respectively equal to three angles of the other triangle directly we can say that their corresponding sides are proportional. Hope you understand, right. See, I am taking another again a pair of triangles. So, this is one triangle let us say triangle ABC and another triangle let it be triangle PQR, PQR such that sides of one triangle ABC are proportional to the sides of the other triangle PQR. Okay? I will write what is the information given in the statement. So, information given is in triangle ABC and triangle PQR and triangle PQR first side by first side AB by PQ is equal to second side by second side BC by QR is equal to third side by third side that is AC by PR. Okay? Corresponding sides are proportional. Then what are you going to prove? We are going to prove that their corresponding angles are equal means angle A is equal to angle P, angle B is equal to angle Q and angle C is equal to angle R. This is what you need to prove. So, whatever the construction I have considered in order to prove AAA similarity, I am going to take the same construction here also. So, what is that same construction? Taking a point for example, B dash on PQ such that AB is equal to PB dash and another point C dash on PR such that AC is equal to PC dash and then going to join BC. Correct? Now, you see here you need to prove that corresponding angles are equal means angle A equal to angle P, angle B equal to angle Q, angle C is equal to angle R. How is that possible? So, here of course, you will have to write the same construction. After the construction, I am going to prove it. So, in order to prove that, first let me consider the information given in the problem. What is the information given here? AB by PQ is equal to BC by QR is equal to AC by PR. I will take that AB by PQ it was given 
is equal to a c by p r and then if I observe a b is exactly same as p b dash according to our construction. So, that I am going to write p b dash by p q is equal to a c instead of a c can I write p c dash yes p c dash divided by p r. So, what did you observe here p b dash by p q is equal to p c dash by p r it means according to the converse of basic proportionality theorem by the converse of basic proportionality theorem we can say that b dash c dash is parallel to q r. So, therefore, by the converse by the converse of basic proportionality theorem we can say that b dash c dash is parallel to q r. So, if b dash c dash is parallel to q r b dash c dash is parallel to q r then what can you infer about the angles yes if two lines are parallel you can consider p q as transversal otherwise p r also as transversal. If p q is transversal then you can say that p b dash is equal to p b dash c dash is equal to p q r and p c dash b dash is equal to p r q because both are parallel. So, therefore, we can say that angle p b dash c dash angle p b dash c dash is equal to this angle is equal to this angle. What is this angle here? This angle is angle q and angle p c dash b dash is equal to this angle is equal to angle r right. And if I observe one more thing here that one more thing is triangle p b dash c dash this angle equal to this angle this angle equal to this angle. If I just consider the small triangle and this entire triangle p b dash c dash and p q r see if you observe those two triangles and in triangles p b dash c dash and triangle p q r in these two triangles angle b dash is equal to angle q angle c dash is equal to angle r automatically angle a is equal to angle a because that is the common angle. Can we say that these two triangles the small triangle and this entire triangle are similar by a a a similarity? Yes, triangle p b dash c dash is similar to triangle p q r by a a a similarity. See since these two triangles are similar can you say that they are their corresponding sides are proportional just now we discussed about that. So, therefore, by C P S T what is the C P S T like C P C T? C P C T is corresponding parts of congruent triangles. What is the C P S T corresponding parts of similar triangles? So, their corresponding angles are equal therefore, their corresponding sides are proportional corresponding sides are proportional means first side by first side equal to second side by second side equal to third side by third side. So, first side is P B dash divided by p q is equal to b dash c dash divided by q r is equal to p c dash divided by p r right. This is what according to a a similarity, but according to our construction you need to identify a few things here those few things are what are those few things p b dash is exactly equal to a b according to our construction. So, I am going to substitute back p b dash is equal to a b. So, that a b by p q is equal to b dash c dash I do not know anything about b dash c dash. So, b dash c dash divided by q r is q r which is equal to p c dash p c dash is equal to a c by the construction. So, a c by p r right. But according to the information given here, once you see the information given here, by this information, A B by P Q is equal to B C by Q R. Here A B by P Q is equal to B dash C dash by Q R. So can I say that B dash C dash by Q R is exactly same as B C by Q R? Therefore, we can say that B dash C dash is equal to B C. So B dash C dash is equal to B C means this B C and B dash C dash both are equal 
and now what can you infer about triangle abc and triangle pb dash c dash those two triangles are congruent by s s s congruence you know why according to construction ab is equal to pb dash and ac is equal to pc dash just now we proved that b dash c dash is equal to bc means this side equal to this side so by s s s congruence triangle and this triangle both are congruent if two triangles are congruent then their corresponding parts also equal what are the corresponding parts we know about the sides then corresponding angles are equal corresponding angles means angle a is equal to angle p i i would write this therefore triangle abc is congruent to triangle p b dash c dash by s s s congruence therefore by cp cd by cp ct i would say that angle a is equal to angle p angle a is equal to angle p what is the second one angle angle b is equal to angle b dash but angle b dash is equal to angle q we already proved here so angle b is equal to angle b dash is equal to angle q it means angle b is equal to angle q and finally angle c is equal to angle c dash is equal to angle r therefore angle c is equal to angle r so this is about converse of a a a that is s s s similarity so according to this s s s similarity criterion if three sides of one triangle are respectively proportional to the corresponding three sides of the other triangle then their corresponding angles are equal this is what you call as s s s similarity so hope you understand what is this s s s similarity thank you